He's a street corner, a stoop, a blindfolded blunt, a nuclear bomb in the middle of Brooklyn. He's a thunderclap in the womb of death. He's a black boy, a tranquilized metaphor, a twice ghetto, shackled to the midnight in his hands. And he's shooting hoots, shooting up in the mouth. Middle passengers, corn rolls, maps back to the interior, back to Shango, back to the spirits babbling, spitting, babbling, spitting, babbling, spitting, multidimensional black boys. Cotton seeds, tobacco sheds, apartheid, Jim Crow, church boy, field hands cross over like time travel. In slave ship tenements, he's a fifth of vodka, the black requiem lost in fragments of its own genius. He's government cheese and divinity, food stamps and infinity, immune to the cyanide in the quarter water, the heat translates these dark boys into small songs, into a canvas of spilled insanity, into the chaos trapped in a star's heartbeat. All this chaos, this conjured oblivion, this resistance among the dark boys with their scrawny arms and their sagging pants, scarlet eyes squeezed tight by cannabis, seas of confusion, the perfume of wasted years in his collarbones, and he's addicted to street corners and sneakers and malt liquor. He's addicted to the taste of his forefathers' sweat in the tobacco leaves. All oh, that Hennessy dreaming beneath his tongue, next to the razor, next to the history of ancestors planted below Wall Street, next to the memories of a father he's never seen. And he wants to go places. He really, really fucking wants to go places. So he's writing his name on everything that moves. Pen his greatest verse on the window of a train and watch it slide off into the killing twilight. It said, Dear world, what have I done for you to hate me so? He's a black buffalo walking backwards through the wheat, survivor from a million noosed philosophies. Africa choked from his acoustics, a dying world on his face, poplar splints from sea to shining blindness. He was born invisible. With a tornado smile. Sit still, black boy. Keep calm, black boy. Don't move, black boy. And Shango can't save him from these white men who pray to the turbine and the jet engine, to their cell phones and their murdered minks, to their satellites and their news briefs. But he, he doesn't give a fuck because he's a street corner, a stoop. A blindfold and blunt, a nuclear bomb in the middle of broken, a thunderclap in the womb of death. He's a black boy, twice ghettoed, shackled to the midnight in his hands.